my channel presentation skills. I hope you are doing well. My name is Mohammed. I'll be your instructor during this tutorial. I am so glad to have you with me on this channel. In this video, I'll be teaching you how to create a presentation of a beautiful car animation. Without further ado, let's start this tutorial. To create this presentation, we need to add a background image of a road. I have already downloaded a background image of the road. Hence, we'll go to the Insert tab, then click on Pictures, then click on this device, and choose the picture from the desktop, and click on Insert. Now, click on Control X to move this image to the clipboard, then right-click on the slide and go to Format Background. And in Format Background Pane, click on this option, Picture or Texture Fill, and click on Clipboard. This will add the image as a background to the slide. Then we can close this background format pane. Now, we need to add a transparent image of a car. I have already downloaded a transparent image of a beautiful car from Internet. Hence, I will go to the Insert tab, click on Pictures, then click on this device. And I'll choose the car of my choice. Then I'll click on Insert. Now we need to extract the tire from this car to complete this project. Hence, we'll go to the Picture Format tab and click on this Option Crop. Then again, we'll go to the Crop option and go to this option, Crop to Shapes, and then choose the Shape Oval. Again, go back to the Crop and then choose the Aspect Ratio of 1 to 1. Now align the car like this. To extract the tire, hold the Control Shift key and shorten its size like this. I will fast forward this for the purpose of brevity. Now we have successfully extracted the tire of this car. Now we'll again go back to the Insert tab, click on Pictures, then click on this device and choose the car, and click on Insert. Now, we'll crop this a bit to take out the extra unwanted area. Now the car is ready. The tire is ready. Now we need to resize the car a bit. Hence, we'll resize it like this until we are satisfied. Now, we need to resize the tire as well. Bring it to the front. Now we'll make a copy of this tire by clicking on Control D. And drag and drop it here like this. To create this presentation effectively, we need to zoom out the slide to 50% like this. Now we'll click on Control A to select all, and then hold the Shift key and move all the objects outside the slide like this. Then click anywhere on the slide to unselect them. Then choose the car and click on Control D to make another copy of this car, and then align it back exactly to the previous car. Then hold the Shift key and drag and drop another car in the opposite direction of the slide. We keep this car here just for the purpose of reference. Now, we need to animate the car. Hence, we'll choose the car and go to Animation. We'll go to Add Animation, and then we'll go to Motion Paths, and choose this Animation Lines. Then go to Effect Options, and choose the direction right. Now click on this red point. Hold the Shift key and drag and drop it on this car, and then we'll animate the tires. We'll go to Add Animation, and we'll go to Motion Paths, and choose the same Animation Lines. Now, we'll go to Effect Options, and choose the direction right. Now, we will click on this red point, hold the Shift key, and drag, and drop it here like this. Then we'll animate this tire as well. We'll go to Add Animation, go to Motion Paths, and choose this Animation Lines. Go to Effect Options, and choose the direction right. Now click on this red dot. Hold the Shift key, drag, and drop it here like this. Now, we need to change the animation settings. Hence, we'll open the animation pane. We'll choose all the animations. 
and go to the Effect Options, we'll remove Smooth Start and Smooth End, and then go to the Timing option. Then we'll make it start with Previous. Give it a duration of 10 seconds. Make it repeat until end of slide, then click on OK. Now, we need to add another animation to these two tires. Hence, we'll choose this first tire. Go to Add Animation and we'll choose this animation spin. And we'll choose this second tire and go to Add Animation and we'll again choose the same animation spin. Now, we'll choose these two animations and go to Effect Options and then we'll go to Timing Options. We'll make it start with Previous. Then we'll give them the duration of 3 seconds and make them repeat until end of slide. Congratulations! Our animation is ready now. If we go to the slideshow, we'll be able to see what we have created. Therefore, let's go to the slideshow and see how it's looking. Isn't it amazing? If you want to create such beautiful presentations, please subscribe to our channel, Presentation Skills, and share this video with as many friends of yours as possible so that they can also benefit from this tutorial. I'll see you in the next video. Until then, take very good care of yourself. Thank you so much for watching this video. May God bless you.